First at six, a sex date turns out to be a trap. A man ended up getting stabbed and robbed in White Lake. Two people now in custody face charges, including attempted murder. Police say they lured the man to the Brentwood Golf Club on Havenwood Drive. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell is live at the Oakland County Jail with a story you'll see only on 7. So Kim, how did police catch these suspects? Well, police tell me this couple made numerous mistakes, so police were able to track them down. That's why they're now in the Oakland County Jail here. Police tell me they used their own cell phones to set up this meeting in a golf club parking lot for sex. The call came into 911 just after 2 in the morning on Thursday. A 49 year old man said someone stabbed him numerous times here in the Brentwood Golf and Country Club parking lot. Police responded and found the man had been violently attacked, stabbed multiple times in the arm and abdomen. So what led to this? Police say the man told them he went on the website meetme.com and connected with the woman who told him she wanted to have sex with him for cash here in the parking lot while the golf club was closed. He showed up with cash. The 25 year old woman got in his truck and then a 19 year old man she came with suddenly broke his window, attacked him and stole his money. A canine unit responded and helped police track the attackers to a house about an eighth of a mile away. Now Haley Ledgley and Matthew Wagner are both in the Oakland County Jail, charged with assault with intent to murder and armed robbery. It turns out police say they were staying with one of their grandparents who lives in the luxurious golf community. Police have extensive amounts of evidence, including surveillance video and text messages. I did speak to a defense attorney assigned to this case, and she told me that she has no comment on behalf of her clients at this time. In the meantime, the couple remains locked up here at the Oakland County Jail with a $200,000 bond, no 10%. Reporting live in Pontiac, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. All right, Kim, thank you so much for the live report.